Welcome viewers to another Rage Armor Tips and Tricks. This one I'm going to show off how to replay Dead Money and get infinite bars of gold, essentially. Now, in order to do this infinite bars of gold, essentially, thing, is you have to play all the way through Dead Money once again. But hey, it's good for experience, and you can see the different endings that you can get. And in addition to showing off how to replay Dead Money and all that fun stuff, I'm going to also show off how to keep Dean Domino alive in Dead Money. Because apparently no one knows how to do this. Now, if you're wondering why I'm getting on right now, even though I haven't gone through the trouble of deactivating Dead Money at the moment, it's just one so that way I can... That way I can, uh... show that I have completed dead money on this file, all that fun stuff, and in fact I'm almost level 50, so yeah. But I need to get on and show off that, yeah, I've completed dead money, all that fun stuff. Excuse me. So yeah, lucky 38, all that fun stuff. Got my bars of gold. Showing off that yes, I have completed Dead Money. Just to be doubly doubly triply sure, Sierra Madre broadcast, Dead Money Where completed. I... So, without further Wait. dudes, let's go and okay. get off. And finally show y'all how to do this. Now, this glitch I figured out when I got my new game console. How this works is you need to have Dead Money downloaded onto your account from a different hard drive, different system entirely, and have it transferred over to a new system. Disconnect from whatever internet you're on, and get back into Fallout New Vegas. Of course, make sure that you have it... Make, it well, we'll show you in just a second. Just make sure that you know basically how to save. Durr. But yeah, bas basically how I figured this out was one day the internet went out and I wasn't able to play in Dead Money because that's where my that's that's where I was saved at so it ported me back to the uh, Mojave Desert. And yeah. Without Dead Money on just get into your whatever profile you want to do and just just to show it off all are equipped or all are on except for the dead money and the uh, courier thing when you don't have dead money on save file it may be corrupted blah 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 this is just saying that you've done it right now I don't know if there are any long-term effects like it could royally fuck up your game file or something but all the items that you've gotten from Dead Money will disappear when you do this. However, you can easily get them back. Just to show it off, come on back here. No more gold bars. Along with all the weapons that I got from Dead Money. However, if you hold on to your Sierra Madre chips until after you get out of Dead Money and buy up stim packs, you can actually hold on to them. So, either way, uh, you don't have to leave wherever you are, really all you gotta do is just save and there you go. But I like getting over to the Forgotten Boss Bunker before saving, just to make the trip a little bit shorter. You know, all that fun stuff. So, yeah, I've, I've already got the, uh... I've already got the boss bunker discovered, so that doesn't disappear off your map. I just gotta figure out where the fuck it is. I know it. There it is, abandoned boss bunker. So yeah. Once you save, go on and head back to your dashboard for those who just want to speed it up and reconnect to your internet. I'll be off screening that once I get this all nice and saved in. I, I, I do suggest saving in a new slot just in case there are long-term effects, but I'll go on and get back to y'all once I reconnect to the internet, so be back in a tick. 
Welcome back, viewers. Now that I have reconnected to the internet, getting back into Fallout New Vegas. Um, as far as I know, this only works on the Xbox version. So, uh, those with the PC version, sorry, tough shit. Can't really do nothing for ya. So I ain't got the PC version. So, back into my main profile with all these freaking gamer scores and achievements and all that fun stuff. Running in, blur, 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 blur. log on. Take a few seconds. There we go. Just to show it, come back in here. Got the got uh, the classic pat and the uh, dead money back into the arsenal. So let's go on and uh, load up that save. Also, as for my uh, at as for my current karma status, I don't know what it is about me, but I always end up with good karma. But either way, now that we're back in. Just like any recently downloaded DLC, just run around for a little bit, and eventually it'll pop back up, because currently, if we just try and go in there now, it'll still be deactivated, so we just gotta kinda run around until it, until it pops up. Of course, this, uh, this is being pretty proof positive, because if I come over to here, somewhere, Vault Canteen, all that fun stuff is added to my arsenal, all that fun stuff, you know, law, and whether, there it is! Also, something of note, if you're above level 45, you'll be, huh, I guess it let me keep my level. Well, somewhere, if you're above a certain level, it'll bump you down to whatever the level cap is. Maybe it's maybe the level cap's 55 or something. I I don't know. But either way, just to show off what difficulty I'm coming into this with, and as far as I know, you don't need any specific difficulty. Coming into it with normal. So go on and seek out that radio. Now, just for shits and giggles, I do usually hack that, but. We're just gonna go on and see you when, uh, when Dean Domino makes his appearance. And I'll show y'all how to keep him. Bye.